Cheeksters, hi YouTube. Hope your day is going awesome. Today's video is going to be an outfit challenge. I am doing the $100 outfit challenge with my girl Rhonda here on YouTube. So once you're finished watching this video, make sure you click on over and go check hers out. We decided to do um, a work worth themed outfit challenge. Based on the feedback that we both got from both our audiences, we thought doing a workwear challenge would be perfect. So let me know if you like these type of videos and if you guys would want me to do other challenges like this. If we haven't met, hi, my name is Chi Chi and I am the blogger behind SuppleChic.com and SuppleChic TV here on YouTube where we cover fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So if you like outfit challenges like today, lookbooks, styling videos, hauls, all all those good things then you are in the right place please consider subscribing down below and of course if you are already subscribed hey girl hey um okay so I cheated a little bit a teeny teeny bit okay because I believe well I don't I don't I don't feel like I cheated because we didn't really say that I had to go in store and buy these things. <laughs> um, so I ordered most of this stuff online, but in the spirit of the challenge and because most of um, the challenges I've seen here on YouTube, people have actually gone in store, I decided that I was gonna go ahead and go in store for the last outfit, right? I was gonna do one bonus outfit so that, you know, I actually did it the way it's supposed to be done. I think, I think, I think. Anyway, I've rambled long enough. So if you're here for this Target challenge, then let's get into it. Guys, so we are here at Target. Let's go in and see what we can find. So I came to the, the plus size section. Um, I can typically fit a the plus size section, but I can also fit um, there are larger sizes in the straight size section, so I can fit an XXL depending on the cut of the item, or even an 18 in skirt. So I just saw these pants, and I think they would go really cute with the spotted. Guys, so I feel like I have perused enough. So guys, I made it back finally. Actually, to be honest, this is another day, but you know, let's just act like this was yesterday. So I went to Target. I feel like I was successful, yes. Um, I was able to grab uh, a full-ish outfit. So let's go through these outfits. All right, so for the first look, I am wearing a leopard top. I feel like a leopard top is a must have. It's basically a basic, basically basic. Um, it's basically a basic um, and it, it's a great piece to kind of like add a pop of print to your work wear. It'll go with all of your neutral colors. Um, so I paired it with a high-waisted A-line pencil skirt. Um, and then for shoes, I'm wearing these Target Mules that I picked up last year. Even though we decided that we weren't going to include bags and shoes, I decided to go with a, um, a pair of shoes from Target just to kind of give you a gist. Um, and then the bag, of course, is not Target because we said shoes and bags did not have to be from Target. Um, so let's break down the cost for this look. All right, so. The leopard top came to $19.99. It was the most affordable piece in um, the outfit. The skirt was $27.99. Now my mules came to $24.99, but sadly they're out of stock. I did find a similar pair for $29.99. And then of course my bag is not from Target, but I did find a similar bag for $34.99. So in total, if you wanted to recreate this outfit, you would spend about $110. Now, like I said, we did not include bags and shoes into this challenge, so if I was going just based off of the main, the top and the skirt, I was way below budget, like around 60. So that was the first outfit. Now for the second outfit, I wanted to show you how you could actually wear jeans to work. Now these jeans, and yes, they are jeans, are cut like trousers, they're like a paper bag waist, they have pleating and seaming, and by the way, if you hear any noise, I guess planes are flying right now? I don't know. Anyways, 
um yeah so so they kind of look like trousers but they are actually made out of jeans i didn't even know that when i ordered them online but um i paired them with this shirt that i currently have on in this video this is actually from the um the victoria beckham collection that was out a couple of years ago you know of course that target did do a, a 20th anniversary collection where they brought back some of their favorites um so this shirt of course is no longer available but i did find a similar shirt so of course i will link to similar things down below um and then i paired it, of course with the jeans and then i went with the same bag um that i went with the first time and finished up with brown pump so that's the look. So let's break down the cost for this look. So the price of the white pants are $36.99. Now, of course, I wasn't able to find this exact top, so I linked to something very similar, and that top is priced at $22.99. Um, we're in luck. Um, I was able to find some brown pumps on Target on Super Sale, $7.50. Now, the regular price is like $29.99, but... I did find brown pumps and I found them in white with as well for $7.50. I would run right now. And then of course for the bag, that is also $34.99. So the total for the whole look would be $102, 102 and seven cents. Okay, we're just gonna go with, without the bag, the total would be $67.48. So for the final look, the look that I actually went in store and picked up, I went with a polka dot um, pullover sweater uh, from Ava and Viv. And then I also went with these plaid pants that have like similar coloring. The, as you can see, the polka dot sweater is giving me all pumpkin spice vibes. And the um, plaid pants have a similar sort of like striping going through to match the sweater. Um, for shoes, I was gonna do like mules again, like flat mules, but I didn't like the way it looked. I preferred it with the pump, so I went with a black pump and then for a bag i found this really cute handheld satchel um that's snake skin so it has some black in it to kind of tie in the pumps and it has some brown in it to tie in the polka dots from the shirt so this sis is how you mix prints at work i think it's a cute outfit and it's totally appropriate for work let me know your thoughts down below and so here is the breakdown for the pricing all right so the sweater is the um, pullover sweater is going to be twenty two ninety nine, and then the plaid pants are going to be twenty seven ninety nine. Um, the black pump, of course, this is my own black pump. Um, these are not from Target, um, but I did find again similar pumps online. And one thing I like about Target with their pumps, they carry regular, like medium width, and they carry wide width. So I found the similar pumps online for twenty. $29.99 and then of course the bag was $34.99 now for the top pants and shoes it's gonna be $80.97 and if you add the bag on it's gonna come to $115.94 so guys let me know did I cheat <laughs> I felt like I did a little bit. Um, leave your comments and your thoughts down below. Which one of these outfits would you totally wear to work? I love Target for great, affordable, on-trend finds, and that includes workwear. So if you're wondering about anything I have on right now, my shirt, this hair, um, my makeup, which I actually filmed the video for, details to everything will be down below. If you like this video, share it with a friend. And of course, make sure you jump on over to Rhonda's channel and see how she did with the $100 challenge. Follow me on Instagram if you're not following me for real-time updates. Read my blog, suppleshek.com. And don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And until next time, stay blessed. I don't know if it's the 20s when they did the silky dresses, but it is this gorgeous, ruffled,